children sai ram let us start with our chapter surface area and volume do you remember what we have done in last part yes we have started with the cylinder correct so and we have seen what is a curved surface area and total surface area of cylinder so let us revise the formulas first and then we will continue with exercise 13.2 so for a cylinder do you remember the figure correct what is the radius and height yes here in a cylinder the top and bottom both are in circular shape the radius of that circle we will denote as r and height is h we will denote by h height is a height of the cylinder so by using that we can write the curved surface area equal to 2 pi r h correct so r is a radius h is a height and the total surface area equal to 2 pi r in the bracket r plus h yes so these both the formulas you have had it clear and solve the sum okay so let us continue with exercise 13.2 see the question number 5 A cylindrical pillar is fifty centimeter in diameter and three point five meter in height. Find the cost of painting the curved surface of the pillar at a rate of twelve point five zero per meter square. Always read the question carefully. Find out the given part and what you want to find. Okay, so cylindrical pillar is fifty centimeter in diameter. so the diameter is given as 50 cm is it correct so what will be the radius because in formula we required radius radius equal to 25 50 by 2 but again 25 will be in cm and the rate is given per meter square so convert 25 cm to meter so how to convert do you remember the last period i explained you how to convert so centimeter to meter smaller unit to bigger unit always you have to divide yes centimeter is a smaller unit so 1 meter equal to 100 cm so divide by 100 so you will get it as what 0.25 meter is it correct then what is the next given 3.5 meter is height correct so h value is given as 3.5 find what we want to find find the cost of painting of curved surface area so curved surface of the pillar that means here we want to find the csa value that is curved surface area and then find the total cost so let us start with the answer so first we will write given height equal to 3.5 meter then radius equal to diameter is given as 50 so 50 by 2 equal to 25 cm and that cm convert it into meter as 0.25 meter then write the formula curved surface area of a pillar equal to 2 pi r h then write the solution we will start with the formula once again the curved surface area equal to 2 pi r h substitute the values 2 into 22 by 7 into 0.25 into 3.5. So do the calculation. 7 ones are 7, 7 fives are 35. Correct. So 0.5 into 2 will be how much? 5 twos are 10. So 1.0 is 1. So just here to multiply 22 into 0.25. Yes. So I find the answer. So you will get it here as two into twenty-two into zero point two five into zero point five. As we have cancelled here, seven ones are and seven fives are. Then two into zero point five will become as one. Therefore, twenty-two into zero point two five will become as five point five meters square. So this is a curved surface area. Then find the cost. The cost of painting one meter square is twelve point five zero. Therefore, cost of five point five meter square will become five point five into twelve point five zero. Please multiply yourself in a rough book and then check the answer, so that you will be very clear with your concept. Then see the answer. Answer you will get it as 
68.75 so write the final answer therefore the cost of painting the cut surface area of a pillar is rupees 68.75 correct so see the next sum question number 6 cut surface area of a right circular cylinder is 4.4 meter square if the radius of a base of a cylinder is 0 0.7 meter find the height okay so now what is given the curved surface area is given can you see over here 4.4 meter square is curved surface area and the radius is given as 0 0.7 meter find the height so we will apply the same formula so first we will write the given let the height we will consider as h radius of a base of a cylinder is 0 0.7 meter is it correct this both the values and then the curved surface area is given as 4.4 meter square so these two are given values r is 0 0.7 meter and curved surface area is 4.4 meter square so we will consider the height as h and substitute in the formula what is the formula curved surface area equal to 2 pi r h correct so let us start with the solution then so 2 pi r h equal to curved surface area is 4.4 correct so 2 into 22 by 7 into 0 0.7 into h equal to 4.4 so what will happen so 7 is in denominator so 7 ones are 7 ones are so it will become 0 0.1 so you will get is 2 into 22 into 0 0.1 into h but what is 22 into 2 is 44 and 44 into 0 0.1 is 4.4 correct so 4.4 into h equal to 4.4 so what will be the your h value h will become as 1 correct so write the final answer here therefore the height of a cylinder is 1 meter so let us continue with the next sum then the inner diameter of a circular well is 3.5 meter. It is 10 meter deep. First part, the find its inner curved surface area. And the second part, cost of plastering this curved surface area at a rate of rupees 40 per meter square. Now let us see what is given part first of all. The inner diameter is given as 3.5 meter. So again the diameter is given. Okay, yes. So, the diameter is given as 3.5. So, what will be the radius? Radius will become 3.5 by 2. So, R will become as 2 1s are 2. Remain 1 2 7s are 14. And then 0. So, 2 5s are 10. So, you got the R as 1.75. It is 10 meter deep. That means your H equal to 10 meter. So, both the values are in meter. So, find the inner curved surface area. Now, I think till now you have added your formula. So, what is the formula for curved surface area? 2 pi r h. Yes, substitute the value and then we will solve the second part that is a cost of plastering. So, let us start with the given first. Inner radius r is equal to 3.5 by 2 which is equal to 1.75 meter depth depth here we will consider as h which is equal to 10 meter what is the formula for inner curved surface area that is 2 pi r h so now substitute these values in a formula curved surface area equal to 2 pi r h substitute 2 into 22 by 7 into 1.75 into 10 so just do the cancellation that is 7 ones are 7 0 7 twos are 14 remain 3 7 fives are 35 so what will be your next step then 2 into 22 into 0 0.25 into 10 again multiply so what you will get here can you see 2 into 22 will become as 44 0 0.25 into 10 it will become 2.5 now multiply 44 into 2.5 which is equal to 110 
so we got the 110 as what curved surface area yes so we will write the inner curved surface area of a circular veil is 110 meters square now let us see the cost of plastering the cost of plastering 1 meter square equal to rupees 40 therefore the cost of plastering 100 meter square here sorry it is not 100 actually so it should be 110 meter square equal to 110 into 40 which is equal to rupees 4400 so we have covered three sums today and we will continue with this exercise 13.2 in next period also so till that thank you and practice this